HTML and markdown syntax in notes window were supported in Origin 2019b and onwards. In this version, 2022, we have further improved the capability by allowing users to insert images located in projects. Let's take a look. Here, I have a graph, and I have already set up two reports. One is based on markdown syntax, and the other is based on HTML syntax. I wish to insert the graph and an associated image into this report. Let's first bring the image in, which is as simple as locating the image and then dragging and dropping onto origin. This creates a new window, an image window. When you click on the image itself, there are several useful mini toolbar buttons such as display actual size or not, and buttons for rotating, flipping, converting to gray, etc. Another useful feature is an ROI, which is the region of interest. So I can restrict the image to a particular region of interest to me. In this case, I'm going to restrict to some area such as this. And then I can right click, and I can crop the image, so I can reduce the image to just the area of interest. Now let's go to the notes. So here I have my markdown notes window. Let me right click the window title and turn off render mode. Notice that there is also a Control m shortcut key to toggle. So here is the markdown syntax, and these cells are waiting for the graph and image to be inserted. So let's go to the first cell. Go to the HTML menu, add links, add graph slash image, and select graph. Now that I've got that inserted, okay. So now let's go to the next cell. HTML to add links to add graph slash image and insert the image. And then I can do the control M to see how it looks. I wish to change the image size a bit. So let me turn off the render mode again by control M and change these to 200 pixels. Press control M again to turn on the render mode. Now I have a nice report with a title, some text, a graph, and an image. So what's new in 2022? Well, I am able to insert the image that is a part of my project now. Okay, so let's look at the same example in the HTML notes window. So I am again pressing Control M to turn off the render mode. Here's the HTML syntax for the table. So I go in here and insert using the same menu. But based on the context of my notes, the appropriate syntax will be inserted. So in this case, it's inserting the HTML syntax for graph rather than the markdown syntax. Go to HTML, add links, add graph slash image, and add the image. And let's change the width to 200. Control M to render it, and there it is. Hopefully this improvement will help you create nicer reports from Origin using markdown or HTML by combining notes, graphs, and images. Thank you for watching.